Gindorf the tight end in the slot. Nolan gets it blocked away. So Braden Thomas knocks one away from the Salukis. Zeb Nolan on the third down has a man right in his face and it's knocked away. Deformation and I believe the Salukis bring five or six. And you have on that defensive line now for the Bison. Here's the snap and the give. And it is a first down. First carry for Justin Strong. First down, line of scrimmage to 46. A little swing pass near side to Strong. He's got pretty good speed. And he does pick up the first down from one side over to the 45 here. Me how to keep working hard. He's the guy that just snapped it on this third down play. Elliott bounces out of the middle and he gets free over the middle. And he does pick up the first down. Very nice run there by Romir Elliott, a sophomore from Indianapolis. Elliott is his running back, fakes to him, throws on a slant to the wide out. It is incomplete and trying to hit Avante Cox. Now, well, we'll call it 38 or 39 as Gualdoni puts a foot into it. And it is good. So Nico Gualdoni gets the first points on the board and it gives the Salukis the lead, which is 40 seconds to go. Takes the direct snap. Some crossing routes there. Nolan under pressure, and he will try to run from it, and he will not be able to get free. And it's third and long. Third and eight here as Baker sets up and connects over the middle. Does he have first down yardage? I think he does. It's Branson Cone. A little bit, and they got him again. The double clap, Wagey among others. So it's a free shot, a duck. It's picked off by Dom Jones. Dime, Dom. Might as well score you, with you it. You might as well run it back in, but this will not be your first interception <laughs> for North Dakota State. That was State. interesting. I don't know if I've <laughs> I don't know if I've seen, seen people one. give up no. on a play quite like that. Even offside. Back offside. Back Defense. 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 Number five. Well, Baker gives up the middle. And it should be a first down. Success is also as an offense. Williams takes this snap, fakes it, keeps it, and goes for another first down. He's up near midfield to about the 46-yard line. And that's the danger of Javon Williams Jr. The one comes to Strong to the near side, looking for a block. He got one, and in the Strong, Justin Strong, up to about the 35-yard line. So back to back, impressive big chunk plays here from the Salukis. Now Baker's back in at quarterback. He get, no, he pulls it and then hits Combs on a slant. Inside the red zone go the Salukis, and after every big play, SIU has tried to go quick. Go in motion to the wide side. Handoff to Elliott. He scores. First touchdown of the game. Belongs to the Salukis after SIU scored the first points of the game in the first quarter with a kick. Far in this game, the Salukis have done a good job on third down. Baker's going to throw for it. He's going to throw deep. He has a man, Cox. It is caught at about the 36-yard line. Avante Cox tripped up inside the two. But on a third and three, Baker and the boys go big, and it works all the way down to the two-yard line. Junior, number 15, in there. This is their Wildcat setup. Williams, a big bruiser, 245 pounds. He's going to run right up the middle, dives, and he is in. So on fourth and goal, with under a minute to play in the half, the Salukis make good on the long pass to Cox and score it on fourth. 20 seconds left in the half. Nolan will go to the flat to Kobe Johnson, but he could not catch it in stride. It is a first down. The clock will stop to move the chains into the backfield. He'll stay in on third down protection. A lot of time for Nolan. Zips the far out. It is caught on the far side by Jacob. Buys and pick up another first down up to the 48, and the clock will stop at 9. Uh, some momentum behind that throw. Nolan will drop again. He'll be able to step up again. That is Gindorf. Another first down. Inside the 40 to the 38, but there will be one play left in the half. The right, two tight ends in there. Babich is the middle guy on the right side. That's where Nolan is looking. It is headed toward Babich in the end zone, tipped up. Caught, I think. Mm, yes. <laughs> the Bison catch it. The Hail Mary works. Zeb Nolan and crew get six points. Jake Lippy comes away with it. Good freshman slides in there and gets his first NDSU touchdown receiving on the Hail Mary. How about that, Lee? Unbelievable. I was, as I was watching that play develop, I'm thinking usually when you get in this situation, you're underneath. Dot bank slash community. Gate City Bank. For a better way of life, member FDIC. The Bison get the ball in the flat with room to work for Christian Watson. And Watson, a dynamic runner after the catch, picks up the first. On the wide side. 
That's where Nolan's looking. Flushed a bit. Goes to the uh, Lippy. The tie or the Lippy came from across the formation. Caught it, but he will be short of the first down. And ten from the 39. Baker straight back, and he goes down. Logan McCormick around the right corner puts the quarterback down all the way back toward midfield in the beat deep. Out of the gun. Good time for Nolan looking at the cross and he finds Christian Watson. There's that first down up to the 30 across the 30 to the 32 and the Bison offense stays on the field. Make it third and 11. Hand off Ganella. Dom Ganella trying to force his way across the 40. He stretches. Did he pick up the first down? It is oh so close. Yes. Yep. Their own 45. Four-man rush. Nolan has plenty of time. Fires over the middle, and it's caught. It is a first down to Josh Babbage. Not a few back-to-back -back first downs. Nolan on the play fake. Looking deep. The ball's on the field. It came away, and it looks like the Salukis are on top of it. The quick change is pulled in by the defensive play. Jordan Brenner. Has man, man open, but... This is some of that pressure we talked about. I don't know if that, I think that's a corner. It is a corner blitz. Yeah, or a safety blitz. Thing. Baker looks, takes a shot deep to Cox, and it's there, up to about the 20. Point lead. That's Cox in motion. There's a throw on the slant, and that is a touchdown to Lenore. And the Salukis get six more points on the board here early in the fourth, and they make the Bison pay for turning it over. Their, their wish right here. The Bison down 17 late. And there's a pick. Underthrown. Interception. It is Roderick Campbell thrown right to him. So now here is Baker. Nothing there first. Now he's swinging out to Cox. He's one on one. Makes a spin move on Hayes. Close to first down yardage. Quarterback spot, Wildcat spot, whatever you want to call it. He's going to run it. He has some room back to the outside after the spin. And the big man tries to drive in, and he does. Turnover, touchdown. And Elliott will try again, and uh, he was able to get enough to pick up the first down with eight minutes to go. Hill swings it out, near side, nice block on the edge. This is Isaiah Hartup, and the freshman. be a two-time All-State defensive lineman. And this is a fake, it tipped, but I still caught. Well, when it's your day, it's your day. Because I don't think that pass was clean. Well, when you're milking the clock, you don't snap it till it's under five, and that's exactly what Baker and company does here. Throws a little pass into the flat. Hard up, gets past one player and picks up another, or one defender, I should say, and picks up another first down. 39 game winning streak as the Salukis have 31 points to this point. It might be more. Elliott to the corner. He makes a dive for the pylon. Six more. That's Elliott with a touchdown run. For SIU. A lot about the word efficient came out of his mouth a lot. You know, being efficient, getting getting on schedule. Bussey's got a chance to break a big one here. Jalen Bussey cuts back on the angle all the way down to the five. Trying to pick up a touchdown here. And they'll quarterback run it. Zeb Nolan gets the six with 2.16 to go. Not only do you have to bounce back, you have to play the number one team in the country, 39 game winning streak, a team you haven't beat since 2009. Did a good job of getting his team prepared today. So the Salukis add win number two, their first of the spring. 